Today we're going back to the late 70s, early 80s. We are doing some BG stuff. I've got really no basis for what the hell I'm doing here. Uh, only thing I do know, uh, and that's because ChatGPT told me, is that they use a TR-808, and then I watched some studio footage, and they also use the real instruments. So we have Superior Drummer right here. Uh, it's just playing this one little loop, and it is just this kit. It kind of sounds strange. This is what the loop sounds like, though. Nice thick low kick, pretty deep, like crunchier snare. Nothing really rings out. And that's being layered with the TR-808 with a little bit of uh, non-linear reverb because it is the 80s. So this is what we got so far. Now, we need a bass line straight out of the bat just so we can get, you know, that that uh, that vibe pretty much. Um, we need that bass line in order for everything to kind of be a little groovy. I've been listening to a lot of tragedy by the Bee Gees. Um, so take that as you will. This might be a little more inspired by tragedy, but who knows? Uh, I'm gonna choose a J bass. Well, let me see, I'm gonna search up on ChatGPT. Okay, precision bass. ChatGPT says a precision bass. So we're doing the pre-bass here. So I need like a yeah and then i'll put it through like a vintage bass because we're doing 70s right so we'll go svtr classic or something SVTR classic. and then this is going to be like the fill right the like the little transition section Oh, that sounds so good. Let's ask ChatGPT what synths. Jupiter, OBX, CS80. Okay, so let's just go into, uh, or actually, you know what? Diva's got really nice Jupiter and Juno stuff, so. Ah! Do we do that? What do we do? I think that's better. Definitely way better with the higher octave. Juno. Maybe the Jupiter right now. Jupiter, no Juno. Juno, and then we want like, hmm. Yeah, what's the next chord in there? I don't even know. Yeah. Yeah, we need some horns, obviously. Let's get some horns in there. Oh! How's that sound? I think that's pretty cool. I wonder if we can get like some strings in there. And we want to clap too. We definitely want to clap. Um, but let's just work on some strings here. Um, can we trail or something? Like a bling, you know? Yeah, I think that works. Violin two staccato, yep. Huh. But I want a blah, blah, blah. staccatissimo, maybe. Yep. Ooh. Okay. We need claps for sure. Oh, do we have claps on? Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. TR-77. Yeah, I think that works. Oh, 
Perfect. Perfect. Obviously we can, we're gonna make that better. A huge part of the sound, by the way, is the nonlinear R, uh, AM, AMS RMX 716. That sounds like gibberish. Um, it's this right here. It's the nonlinear reverb. It sounds like this. Very 80s. We almost need a longer one for that. I think we'll do that instead. That's better. Sure. Uh, let's do a plate as well. Yeah. Now we need actual claps, of course. A layer of claps right here. Maybe one more layer of claps, why not? Kind of want these to also go through the same reverb. There we go. Turn that down. Oh yeah, perfect. That is exactly what I wanted. Hmm. This bass needs some room for sure, I think. Maybe, maybe not for sure, maybe just I think. Just needs not really that big of a room. Um, so let's get a realistic room with Sound City Studios. That makes sense. It's a 70s, it's a 70s studio. Yeah, we can probably bring the drums in there, like the acoustic drums in there. Okay, it's a little too much now, actually. We can also engage the chamber. Why not? Also, I think this should have more of an open hat. Yeah, I think... Leave it open on one of the bars. And then because we want that from the hi-hat, but we're doing an open hi-hat, so we can't really do that, you know, because it'd be too messy. We have to add a shaker to keep that rhythm going. Yeah, that's a shaker. Now we need a tambourine. <laughs> that's funny. That's it right there. I'll tell you what, let's um, just kind of build out the session a little more. So first, shaker. And cut out. Oh, and then it comes back in. Come on, come on. Who do you think I am? Oh, and then I got like a boom, ticka, um, ticka, um, ticka, um, ticka, you know, you know, you know? Oh, ho, 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 ho. maybe we'll do like an extra bar. We definitely have to uh, fix those toms. And then, you know what? Let's just kind of fucking add a flanger. Why not? ADA flanger might be the vibe. Definitely was the vibe. Oh, ho, ho. and then we're going to cut everything out here. Then we're going to bring it all back. All right, we need a better better one there, um, for sure. Cut everything out, though. Did it cut out? Yeah, where's that horn? We don't need those horns. Maybe? 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 
Let's bring back that flanger. Bring it back. Bring it back. No such thing as too much flanger. Uh, guitar time. Come on. Hit it harder. Hit harder. Hit harder, please. It's done. We're done. We had too much fun today. No more fun. It's a Thursday. No one should be having this much fun on a Thursday. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something. I don't know what I learned. I just learned that Megan Funk is fun as hell. So um, if you didn't take anything home, take that home. Uh, yeah, that's it. Okay, bye.